suspension there that you were filming on this plane for six months. Yes. I know it's a set, but like, it's still claustrophobic at times. What is a challenging aspect of shooting on a plane, essentially, for six months that we might not know about? Uh, I guess, look, you know, like on a plane, a real plane, the AC works all the time. On a set, not so much. Um, we did shoot on a real plane and we basically dismantled it and put it back together in the studio. There's 400 extras, actors, plus the crew, plus the lights. I mean, it was a lot, it was a lot to deal with. But I think the biggest challenge is being, you know, it's a six hour flight, but being the continuity over six months, that was the hardest part. Um. I love the fact that we've seen a hijacking thing before and the protagonist might be like a cop or, you know, off duty something. We're a negotiator, such an interesting spin on things. What qualities did your character need and what do you think you brought to the role? My character, character needed to understand people, you know, sort of figure out their weak spots, figure out how to compliment them, figure out how to make them trust. And that's what negotiators do in, you know, acquisitions and mer mergers. And that's where my character was. I don't think it was quite ready for hijackers, you know what I mean? Especially this set. So uh, he used, I guess, a little bit of charm, a little bit of uh, sense. I think he was playing chess. And final cheeky one from me. You were talking to uh, Lorraine today. We've seen the headline saying, Idris having a great old for Lorraine, which leads me to think, aside from myself, for you right now, who is your favorite person to be interviewed by? Uh, you? Oh, you nailed it. Congratulations, thank you. Thank you very much. This is a show, it's, just, it's just full escapism, uh, no pun, but it really is an old school, an old fashioned sort of uh, thriller. It's really well thought out. It's not, the, you know, there's no tropes. So what you think about hijacking and just throw it out the window and put your seatbelt on. Oh, couldn't help myself. But it's going to be fun. It's really well done. I'm not just saying that, but it really is. What were your favourite moments filming? Uh, on rap, going home. I really loved that moment. I, I keep saying to people, it's like the longest flight I've ever taken. It was like six months making a film, about a six-hour flight. There's an irony there, but it was a lot of fun making it. How are you? Again, I straight ahead, please. And what, what attracted you to the whole uh, well, first of all, the idea of doing something that is just old school entertainment, but done in a way that no one's seen before. And, and a hijack, we've seen it all before, but doing this in a different way was really interesting. George Kay is a phenomenal writer, and I wanted to work with him, and I thought, here's the opportunity, so yeah.